Scratch, I don't think you're mean. I think you're actually possibly the best person for your cat. That cat has to be one of the most stubbornest creatures I've ever seen in regards to not wanting to move, or at least not wanting to do anything but bask in the sun and act like Garfield, sponging up the sun. That said, let's see. Let's tally off the items that you decided to gently uh, throw to your cat. Uh, an elastic band used for hair. A blue rose, or was it two blue roses tied into one? Uh, can't figure out what that third item was. Looked like a change purse, but sounded like a set of keys. Uh, and then you decided to throw uh, the uh, ear earphones, which at that point I'm surprised the cat didn't decide to attack it. Uh, because they tend to want to attack string or anything that falls on them. Or any, actually, I'm surprised the cat didn't decide to attack anything. Um, just laying there, letting you do what you wanted to do to prove the point. I'm trying to remember the cat's name, and I think it's Catter. Uh, if that's the case, anyways. Cats are enjoyable creatures. They love to bask in the sun. They take up the classic loaf position somewhere, and you turn your back, you come back, and then they're a pretzel. Funny, ain't it? Very flexible animals. Believe it or not, a cat will get injured at a lower height than if you actually see a cat drop from a higher height. That said, have a nice one.